use all the theories of human networks. Like the kind of the learning that I showed for perceptron is called Hebbian learning. It was first invent, uh, first understood by Dr. Donald Hebb back in 1940s, and he used that to understand how neurons form connections in our brain. That if two neurons fire together because of something, then the connection between them will be strengthened. If the neurons fail to fire together, then the connection will be weakened. And that is the exact principle that perceptrons use. We have just quoted that Hebbian learning into this. And in fact, large scale, you have heard, I, you might have heard of uh, Cambridge Brain Project or large scale human brain mapping projects, where we are trying to map large scale brain networks based on the based on similar principles as to a neural network. We want to see now how different parts of the brain connect together and try to learn and what failures arise from if some connections are not there.